hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Oh, what you say? Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Oh, woman, oh, woman, don't you treat me so mean. You're the meanest old woman that I've ever seen. I guess if you say so, I have to pack my things and go. That's right, hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. Oh, what you say? Hit the road. In the news, nuclear missile explodes over Europe. But first, what OJ had for breakfast. <laughs> Ryan is throwing up in the bathroom and he won't let me in to do my makeup. Make him get a bucket like you and Ross. Ooh, but don't breathe on me. I don't want to catch anything that could leave me looking like you. I don't mean that as an insult because you look old. I just meant like red-nosed, pale, bloated, and ugly. Oh, I think that deserves a kiss. <coughs> Come get it. Oh. Please, Mom. It's only two days until the big Alpha Pi Psi party at the college. This fraternity party will be full of the nerdiest guys on campus. But today's big doofus is tomorrow's Bill Gates. So I figure I'll go down there and prance it. And these guys will remember the slim redheaded girl, the shiksa of their dreams. <laughs> then, in a few years when they're rich and ready to dump their ugly first wives, I'll give them a call and be there for them. <laughs> yes, Tiffany Malloy. Trophy wife. Exactly where is this party, and do you think I can pass for a senior? I'm dying. So? Oh, come here, baby. Kill! Oh. I don't know where I got this bug from. Can't you take this little snot monster for one minute? It was your animal urge. You pay for it. Are you finally done in the bathroom? Nope. <laughs> Watch the big emergency. I rushed right over. We all have colds. Look, Dad, I threw up. See, that looks real nice, son. Hey, I thought I told you to call me when you make corn. <laughs> Quick enough today, didn't you? What do you want? We want you to go get us some soup at Mel's. Mel's? It's clear across town. What's wrong with Arts? I said Mel's. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Is that your little show of defiance? Yes. Can we order now? Yes. I will have a mixed salad with extra carrots. Salad. I'll have chicken soup with no carrots. Oh, I'll have chicken noodle with some carrots, not too many. Oh, wait, you know what? Change my order. I will have a Cobb salad, but turkey instead of ham. And for God's sake, shredded carrots, not sliced. Oh, it's right next door to that yogurt place. That'll soothe our stomachs. We'll have vanilla with sprinkles. Yes. Yogurt. Oh, hey, we're ordering food? Well, I'm really sick, so uh, just get me a cheeseburger with onions, French fried onion rings, and a chocolate malt. I'll see you, Dad. I'm going back to throw up. <laughs> At least the kid knows what he wants. He doesn't care if I go to Mel's or not. You're going to Mel's? All right. <laughs> That's right down the street from Roscoe's, so uh, why don't you bring me some barbecued pork ribs? You know what? Bring me the cheeseburger, too. I can't keep anything down. <laughs> you know, while you're out, you'll probably pass a drugstore somewhere. Buy me some tampons. <laughs> Paragraph 6, Article 4 of our divorce agreement says, the former spouse shall not make unreasonable requests of the other former spouse. Paragraph 6, Article 4, subparagraph 2. This does not include the purchase of tampons. Damn. Besides, I don't want to buy them. It's embarrassing. <laughs> and don't forget, flushable applicator super absorbency. You want the string on the side or sprinkles on top? <laughs> okay, okay, I'm going. Where are the keys of the car? 
oh, it's in the shop. You're going to have to take the bus. But listen, whatever you do, be careful, Jack. There are dangerous, demented, diseased people on the bus. Stay between them and our food. <laughs> well, but it feels better without a condom. Yeah, check back in 16 years. <laughs> Man, what a life. <sighs> well, it's good to be home. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I'm fine, really. What are you doing? The death scene from Camille? <laughs> I'm bored, Jack. I don't want to be alone. Somehow my madcap little wisecracks aren't quite so funny when there's no one to hear them. Jack, it's me. I know you're sitting there. Jack. Oh, playing this, are we? Pick up that phone. <laughs> well, you're lucky you ran out of here so fast. The soup was cold, the yogurt was hot, but it doesn't really matter because the tampon soaked up everything. <laughs> We're still sick and I need you to pick up my car. And as long as you're out, give me more tampons and get some lollipops. Do it for the kids so they don't think I'm the only one who cares about them. Can I have green lollipops? I'm on the phone, I'm on the phone, I'm on the phone! <laughs> Just where do you think you're going, young man? To get the car. Well, how about taking me along once in a while? I'm sick of waiting for you to ask me out. Look, you know I can... Oh, no. <laughs> You've already ruined it by not asking me yourself. Listen, I am not going to take a stuffed bunny out for a ride. I'm going to bang my head until you say yes. <laughs> Not gonna work. <laughs> on the road again! Just can't wait to get on the road again! Can you be any more annoying? Sure. Kumbaya! Kumbaya! Kumbaya, my lord, look at the babes! Embarrassing me. Show us your boobies. <laughs> hey, knock that off. I think you said that one, Jack. Uh oh, they have guns. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't this great? On the move, no responsibilities. <laughs> I haven't had a car in so long, I forgot how great it is. Gee, I wish I could feel like this forever. You can, Jack. Just point it to Mexico and floor it, baby. <laughs> Don't look back. Can't do that. I have a family and they need me. Let me ask you this. What are you going back to? Wait, before you answer that, I just happened to bring this little cassette along. Pop it in, would you? I'm on the phone, I'm on the phone, I'm on the phone. <laughs> Viva la Mexico! Oh, on, on the road, road again! again. Aggie Aggie we get on, on the road, road again. again! On the road again! Oh, we'll, we'll never, never buy tampons again! again. Bitch and they can moan. They can be a mess alone. We will never, never buy, buy tampons, tampons again. again. <laughs> <sighs>
Man, this is great. Adios, L.A. Adidas, Mexico. <laughs> you know, down there, our American dollar goes a long way. How much money have we got? Eleven bucks. <laughs> down there, that makes us solidly middle class. <laughs> I, I'll tell you this much, though. I may be living down there, but I'm not going to learn to speak their language. If they want to talk to me, they can learn English. If they want people to hobble Espanol, they can move to San Diego. <laughs> As long as we're starting a new life, I want a new identity. I want an eye patch, one that makes me cool, mysterious, and dangerous. From now on, I shall be known as Senor Floppy. I believe I killed a man once. No, I think I'd like a new identity, too. I know, I should be a new car salesman. No, 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 they don't sell new cars in Mexico. Think harder. You want to be appealing to men, but attractive to women. Uh -huh. Like Madonna. <laughs> no, appealing to men. I don't want to be appealing to men. Then stop singing YMCA in the shower. <laughs> Look, you just watch out for yourself. We're heading for Mexico. You can very easily find yourself swinging from a tree. Stop with candy. <laughs> Hey, look at those poor saps trying to sneak across the border the wrong way. <laughs> uh, I guess you can't blame them. Everybody wants to be in America. Why not? It's a beautiful country. I mean, after all, we take great pride in this nation of ours. Uh-oh, that cop must have seen me litter. Should I pull over? I hate cops. Floor it! <laughs> the hell with him. Well, now I don't have to lie. I really do have a dark criminal past. <laughs> I'm a litter bug. <laughs> bad boy. The senoritas love bad boys. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to find a guy who litters in Mexico. <laughs> hey, what's that sign say? San Francisco, 10 miles. Damn. <laughs> Well, we're going the wrong way. I don't know, why were all those people trying to run across the freeway? People do damn near anything to get out of Oakland. The report on how to end world famine is being preempted for coverage of the O.J. Simpson trial. Where is that man? He's been gone four hours. Mom, did you ever think once Daddy got in the car, he might just run? Oh, not your father. He doesn't have the guts or a sense of direction. <laughs> In or out of the car. Oh, if he didn't run when I told him I was pregnant, he'll never run. If he didn't run when he saw what I was pregnant with. <laughs> what do you mean? Nothing, honey. <laughs> Mom, did you ever think about running? Oh, no, honey. Although it is natural to think about what it would have been like if I'd been on the pill. Well, sure, they, they warned me about all the side effects, but nobody ever talked about the side effects of this. Or this. Or that. <laughs> but I was young, and I thought having a family would actually be fulfilling. <laughs> and it is. Oh, but you should have seen your father when I first met him. He had such cute little hopes and dreams. I remember many a night he'd say, she ate a watermelon, she's not pregnant. And I'd say, wake up, Jack, you're dreaming. Wait a second. If you guys got married in February, and then I was born in May. <laughs> oh, but your daddy was so cute back then. I was too. As a matter of fact, I looked just like you. Oh, my God. You are kidding, aren't you? No, I'm not. <laughs> hey, Mom, how long is a woman pregnant? Six months, dear. You know, I don't think Daddy's ever coming back. I want my lollipop. 
Oh, Daddy will be here with him soon, honey. He'd never run. He's got a conscience and no imagination. <laughs> and that's bad when you're having sex. <laughs> but it's good when you want lollipops. <laughs> Me con ojito? <laughs> Él no te muerde? <laughs> Jack? Hey, Jack, you haven't spoken for an hour. What are you thinking about? <laughs> Jack, you were asleep. Yeah, I. Guess I got to thinking about my life, and I must have nodded off. <laughs> well, thank God you weren't having a conscience attack, thinking about your stupid family. Yeah. Oh, no. Jack? No. Daddy! Danny! Daddy! Danny! Daddy! Daddy! Hold it. <laughs> One at a time. Tiffany? I have to pee. Okay, honey. Ryan? I had to pee. <laughs> but it's a couple daddies too late. Good boy. <laughs> All right, kids, the excitement is building. We'll be at Disneyland any minute. You've been saying that for the last eight hours. <laughs> oh, here's Mexico again. <laughs> oh, look, honey, why don't we just go home? We can settle in and watch Hello, Larry. We can always catch that on rerun. The show's gonna run forever. <laughs> that McLean Stevenson, he was MASH. Without him, that show's over. <laughs> yeah, well, so is this trip. Kids, we're going home because Daddy can't find the biggest amusement park in the whole wide world. Boo, Daddy! Hey, kids, I got an idea. What do you say we go to Mexico land? What's Mexico land, Dad? Oh, it's a magic kingdom full of wonders. And flies. <laughs> you got Siesta Land and Corona Land. Why, you even have reupholstery land. Does it have Pirates of the Caribbean? No, but it's got Montezuma's Revenge. <laughs> and the best part is it's only five minutes from here. Yay, Daddy! Oh, Jack, you have such a way with children. Yeah, I guess I do. Good, because I'm pregnant again. <laughs> Yay, Daddy! <laughs> Jack, Jack, you're driving into oncoming traffic. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> no, no, Jack! You didn't have a good memory of your family, did you? No. No, there are no good memories. <laughs> you just pile bad memories on top of bad memories, and before you know it, you've got a life. <laughs> Gee, that's interesting, Jack. We're going back. Why? Man, the truth is, I've been to Mexico land. And sometimes the souvenirs you bring home, though not expensive, are also not curable. <laughs> and if I did run, I probably would never hear another yay daddy again. And I wouldn't deserve to hear one. Jack? You're an idiot. <laughs> Seems that way, doesn't it? Oh, God. What if he really did run? How much do you have to yell at a man? How much do you have to belittle him? How much do you have to nag and nag and nag before he will just do what you say? <sighs> I guess I was just too easy on him. I'm back. No, I was perfect. <laughs> oh, yay, Daddy! <laughs> Gosh, I never thought I'd hear that again. Where are my red lollipops? Where are my green ones? Where are my grape ones? How long is a woman pregnant? <laughs> Take my advice, son. You don't want to stick around long enough to find out. <laughs> Nacho flavor. <laughs> you. You are such a loser. What'd you do, go to Mexico? 
<laughs> now go and get some decent flavors of lollipops and do not come back without them. No problema. <laughs> Put on your sombrero, Senor Floppy. <laughs> Next stop, Mexico. <laughs> Jack, you're out of gas. Yay, Daddy! Hi, honey. Does it ever seem like this thing is looking at you? <laughs> Jack, you tried to run to Mexico, didn't you? What tipped you off? The 3,000 miles you put on my car. <laughs> you never did learn to ask directions, did you? Yeah, you never did understand, just a little south. <laughs> Why didn't you keep going? I think it's because no matter where you go, no matter what you do, you'll have to come back. Because deep in your heart, you know. We both know. I'd hunt you down and kill you. <laughs> I don't doubt it for a second. Good. San Francisco, Jack. Come to Mexico! Oh, bueno! Dear and happily ever after, I think your show is nothing but a cheap ripoff of Married with Children. Fred M., Chicago, Illinois. Fred, that's ridiculous. Does that show have a bunny that talks like me? Plus, we have three children. Three, two boys and a girl. You, sir, are an idiot. Send your evil letters to Dr. Quinn Medicine Women. Don't pick on the little guy. We love you. And be kind to of the frog. He hasn't worked in 40 years. Mm -hmm.